Hello friends, Miss Ward here with our story for today, Pete the Cat and the Perfect Pizza Party by Kimberly and James Dean. I'm excited. I really like this story. Look at all these pizzas. Oh my goodness. Mushroom pizza, fish pizza, mud pizza. Ooh, smelly sock pizza. Gross. Eggs on pizza. Ooh, I've had eggs on pizza. Sweet peas, bacon, olives, broccoli, apples, cupcake pizza, watermelon pizza. Where's that one? Grape pizza. What's this one down here? Blueberry and onion pizza. Oh, pepperoni. That one's my favorite. Pete the Cat and the Perfect Pizza Party by Kimberly and James Dean. I wonder what makes a perfect pizza party. Pete the Cat loves pizza. Pete the Cat loves parties too. Pete had an idea of what he could do. What do you think's Pete's idea? He loves pizza. He loves parties. I wonder what his idea is. It's in the title of the book. That's your hint. Pete would have the perfect pizza party. You are invited to Pete's pizza party. Fun, music, games, bring your swimsuit. Sounds like it's gonna be a pool party. Pete's friends all arrived. It was time to build the perfect pizza together. That would make the pizza even better. Pete thought the perfect pizza would be pepperoni with extra cheese. I'm with you, Pete. I like pepperoni and extra cheese. Here's all the guests at Pete's pizza party. All right, he's got his cheese, he's got his pepperoni, he's putting his pizza together. It's a party, it's a party, it's a pepperoni pizza party. But everyone did not agree. They're playing a game of pin the tail on the unicorn. Uh-oh, everyone didn't agree about the perfect pizza. Callie said, pepperoni would be just fine, but I really love pretzels on mine. Pete and the gang were puzzled. Pretzels? Well, that's something new. Maybe pretzels could be groovy too. That's what Pete said. Oh, they're making a compromise. We talked about that in class. It's a party, a party, a pepperoni pretzel pizza party. Oh, it is a pool party. They're in the swimsuits. They're having a pepperoni pretzel pizza party. Squirrel said pepperoni and pretzels would be just fine, but I really love pistachios on mine. What's a pistachio? You know what? I happen to have some right here. A pistachio is a nut. And if you haven't seen pistachios before, it's a nut that is the color green. Delicious. And the gang were puzzled. Pistachios? Well, that's something new. Maybe pistachios could be groovy too. You know what I like? Pete's really ready to try new things based on his friend's recommendations. It's a party, it's a party. It's a pepperoni pretzel pistachio pizza party. Oh yeah. Grumpy Toad said, pepperoni pretzels and pistachios would be just fine. But I really love, what's he got there? Pickles on mine. Pete and the gang were puzzled. Pickles? Well, that's something new, but maybe pickles could be groovy too. Oh my goodness. So he's got cheese, he's got pepperoni, he's got pretzels, he's got pistachios, and now they're going to add pickles. Oh my goodness. This is quite a pizza. It's a party, a party, a pepperoni, pretzel, pistachio, pickle pizza party. <laughs> They're trying to throw the bean bags into the holes to win some points. Gus said, pepperoni, pretzels, pistachios, and pickles would be just fine, but I really love popcorn on mine. Pete and the gang were puzzled. Popcorn? Well, that's something new, but maybe popcorn would be groovy too. All right, we got cheese, pepperoni, pickles, pretzels, pistachios, and now popcorn. My goodness, 
It's a party, a party, a pepperoni, pretzel, pistachio, pickle, popcorn, pizza, party. Whoa. Look at Pete's pizza party bus. It looks like a pepperoni pizza. I wonder where they're going. Alligator said pepperoni, pretzels, pistachios, pickles, and popcorn would be just fine. But I really love, does anyone know what that fruit is? I'll give you a hint. It starts with the letter P. It's a tropical fruit called papaya. I really love papaya on mine. Pete and the gang were really puzzled. Papaya? Well, that's something new, but maybe papaya could be groovy too. Now what's on their pizza? Cheese, pepperoni, pretzels, pistachios, pickles, popcorn, and now papaya. Here we go. It's a party, it's a party. A pepperoni, pretzel, pistachio, pickle, popcorn, papaya, pizza, party. Where are they? They're in a bounce house. (laughs) Oh my goodness. Pete and the gang piled the pepperoni, pretzels, pistachios, pickles, popcorn, and papaya on top. The pizza was so high, they had to stop. Ding! The pizza was done. Trying something new might be fun. They all built up the courage to take a first bite, and the pepperoni, pretzel, pistachio, pickle, popcorn, papaya pizza was... Out of sight, dynamite, and just right. In the end, the perfect pizza is a pizza shared with friends. The end, there's all those delicious, oh, a french fry pizza, a ketchup pizza, oh my goodness, grapes, strawberries, chocolate, peppers, eggs, interesting. Well, baked beans, (laughs) that one's got baked beans on it. I will say, That pizza sounds pretty interesting. But you know what? I agree with Pete the Cat. He says, the best pizza is a pizza shared with friends. I had a friend when I was growing up. His name was Dr. Jesse Myers, and he used to say that eating is a social matter. So I'm looking forward to those of you who are going to be coming to our lunch bunch tomorrow. If you did not sign up for the lunch bunch, don't worry. There's another one next Friday. So you can sign up and join our lunch party next Friday if you aren't able to make it with us tomorrow and I look forward to seeing you enjoy your evenings and have fun with Pete the Cat and his perfect pizza party. Bye everyone.